Hello and welcome to the Gaming Chronicles. Today we will continue Final Fantasy IV, the Pixel Remaster. So let's load it up. Alrighty, since the end of our last episode, I did grind out just a few levels. I wanted... let's see, I got Rosa. Um, I got Holy for Rosa. And I got Flare for Rydia. Um, I wanted her to be level 55 so we could get Flare. Um... So we got three-ish levels, I think. Uh, this will give us a little bit of uh, help when we go to our next um, our next dungeon. So let's go ahead and click on that crystal, and we are headed back to the surface, or back to the blue planet. Let's go. Oh my goodness, what's happening? So shaky. Oh no, we're too late. Edge <laughs> casts the. Yeah, that's the $64,000 question, eh? The Giant of Babel, oh no! It's a very large robot. Oh, he's burninating everything. How rude. It's like a... Uh, one of those big robots from that movie. Pacific Rim. They have those enormous robots that are piloted by those two people that have to like... I can't remember. They have to, like, synchronize or something? That, that's what this reminds me of. Oh my goodness! This is a long cutscene. Oh no! Ready to summon Bahamut! Summon everything! Uh... Wait! Here comes the cavalry! Or like gnats, uh, compared to this guy. Alright, here come the dwarves. Ha ha ha! Lolly ho! How did they get them up here? It's like, okay, great. Here come the tanks, but how do they get them out of the underworld across the ocean? <laughs> okay, we won't ask too many questions, I guess. We'll just let the tanks shoot. Hey, look, it's Yang and the Sylphs! Get him! Get him! Oh look, here come... well, not the Red Wings. They don't look like they're red to me. Oh, it's Sid with his boys! Hey Sid, what's up? When did you get out of bed? Alright, shoot him down! Hey! <laughs> Look who it is. The Elder restored us. Of course he did. The Elder's amazing. Uh, so the Elder knows some pretty powerful magic uh, to be able to undo break like he did. Oh, Edward. <sighs> Yeah, even Edward's back. You know, sad thing is, Tella, so Tella is the only one who actually dies in uh, this one. And I guess, you know, that's maybe because he's old, he lost his daughter, no posterity or family. They felt like they could kill him off with no problem. It's still sad that Tella died. Not not nearly as many deaths as uh, um, Final Fantasy II, where, like, everybody actually dies what is it three or four of your party members that come you know at one point join you they they die the giant looks confused now is our chance edge suddenly has a deep understanding of giant robotics <laughs> oh, i love it 
we're just gonna jump from one giant airship to another. Go get it, Sid. <laughs> Fusoya's like, what are you do waiting for? I'm gonna die of old age by the time you make a decision. <laughs> there we go. So we have entered the belly of the beast. Alrighty. Love this music. Um. Okay, we need to... How many chests? There's eight chests in this place. Alright, and I don't remember if any of these... <clears throat> excuse me. If any of these guys have like weaknesses or anything like that, I don't I don't know. We'll just do this. Centaurs Centaurians, excuse me. We seem to be doing pretty well against them though. A tent. How fantastic. A shuriken, hey, nice. Oops, not the uh, wrong button. Come on. Oh, hello. I think with Fosoya, I'm just gonna. Uh, I don't know. He seems to be so mediocre despite the fact that he's a Lunarian he is unimpressive a mech soldier now in this place you would you would uh, farm uh, what are they called sirens um, But since we can go, let's see. There will be one point where we're going to do some, um, not really side questing, but th there are some hidden items that I find that, interestingly enough, they're not available until, like, the end. Um, so we'll go get those, and then we'll stock up on some sirens at the same time. <clears throat> Uh, come on now. White magic. Let's uh, do a Kiraga on everybody. Ow. Well, they're, they're a little... They're fast, the enemies, but fortunately their health isn't very high. Experience is okay. <clears throat> ether. All right, we like ether. Ah. I wonder if they're robots and all. If they're weak to, um, if they're weak to thunder. Let's see if praying works. All right, it worked. That eh, does decent damage. It's not amazing, though. Yeah, but it's all right. Uh, let's see.
Get him. <laughs> I, find, I do find it interesting how... Yeah, Siren, hooray! Let's see. And then there's one over here. <clears throat> I think you already have the Yoichiro, yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, an arrow that may cause confusion, effective against giants. Uh, yeah. It's funny that whips are intended for Rydia, but... <coughs> Excuse me, she really has no business. Um, oh really? She really has no business m using melee weapons or, or being, you know, especially being in melee range. Um, so, the fact that uh, her weapon that the, you know, the game intends for her to use is the whip, which is pointless, truly. Alright, who do I want to... Uh... Oh, myself. <clears throat> Alright, get that mech soldier. There we go. Alright, another tent! Fantastic. Okay. We have two chests in here? Or just... Yeah, we have two. Two chests. All right, I uh, will just attack. He's <laughs> um, really he's with Soya. I don't know. Uh, I kind of don't know what to do with him, right? Because his his magic isn't um, his his magic pool, right? His MP, his total MP is so so low that uh, and it never goes up. It's low enough that's like uh, I don't want to. Oops, we have one. Oh, come on. One chest left. Excuse me. Kept messing that up. Okay, anyway. So, I kind of don't know what to do with him because it's like, okay. I want I want to make sure he has MP uh, left over for, like, boss fights. Um, let's see. Uh, I guess let's throw a heal on Cecil. Thousand? Oh, okay. Didn't think that his cura was that strong. Get him. All right, very good. And here we go. Oh, one more fight on this level. Ah, this, uh, the the searcher. Let's see if we can uh, steal a siren. See, this is how we would normally. Yeah, stole a siren. See, this is how we would normally um, farm it. I think you eliminate. Everyone but uh, a searcher and a beamer. Oh, whoops, I messed that up. Um, oh no! Sorry! Um, 
Uh, steel. Yeah, steal the siren. Oh no, it's an alert. So we can just keep doing this forever. Oh no, we got detected. Or not forever, but until, you know, we eventually kill him. Get him. Um, so anyway, that, that's the old way of doing it is, uh, you have just the searcher and one enemy left. Um, have everybody on defend and, uh, you know, heal as needed. And then you just steal, 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 steal. Uh, let's see. That'll do. Oh, right. Giant soldier. Let's see, uh, does he wake to thunder? I can't even remember if he's weak to anything. Uh, let's cast a cure, uh -huh. Or Kiraga, excuse me. Um. Oh, I didn't even see what happened to Edge. I was too busy menuing. Alright, nice. It's in the box. Monsters! The last arm. I don't remember what this guy does, if anything. I guess nothing. Yeah, I don't remember. Probably has some special ability if he doesn't use that stupid search command. Or search action. Hey, what's up, naming way? Um Let's buy a few of these actually. Oh, you can buy shurikens from him. That's cool. Fira, Thundara, Blizzara. Yeah, I don't think we need anything else. Uh, I think this is a save point, right? Uh. Let's go ahead and... Wait, how much is, um, Rama? Rama is 30. We'll do that. Brack magic. <coughs> Magnetic radiation. What does that do? Get him. Oh, that was alright. Not great. Thundaga would have probably been better. Oh, does it incapacitate him? Is that what it does? Um, or slow him down? Hmm. Alright. Fustoya goes up a level. His, the only thing that has ever increased is his HP. Hmm. All right, let's go ahead and use a tent. All right, let's do a uh, save. Uh, we'll go ahead and overwrite this file since this was just a grind file. <clears throat> Alright, and... That 
restored most of our HP or M and MP for everybody. Yeah. All right, here we go. Stairwell of the Giant. I ambushed. Oh, fetch. Uh, let's see how this goes, actually. Let's take out that giant soldier first. Uh, where's Thundaga? <clears throat> um, I'll well, just a regen since I don't know what else to do. He doesn't have a big enough MP pool to really spend it a battle after battle after battle. Get that giant robot. Yeah, get him. Nice. An ogre killer. Ha! <laughs> Funny. It's useless. Okay, here comes our friends. Oh yeah. I think we we fight him in the same order as we did originally. You have taught us of the power that comes from joining forces. That is what we will do. Oh, Rubicante, you are so kind. This time we shall prevail. It's like, we want a fair fight. Um, I, I don't think that you're going to get your wish, though. Just, just so you know. You know. Um, attack. White magic, protect. Um, black magic, I guess just Fira, really. Because the dude will be dead soon. Yeah, cast Fusoya all you, or hit Fusoya all you want. Yeah, he's weak to fire. Curse, oh no. Um. We don't need to use our throwing skill, not really. It's all about the. F it's all about Fira. <clears throat> well, let's go ahead and just uh, cast a Suna on myself. And I like to use Fira because it's um, more. Oh no! <laughs> we just healed him. Oh well, it's a good thing he was already 100%. Um. Let's see, let's uh, cast a Curaga. There we go. Um, and now uh, let's we'll attack. Now we'll do Thundaga -ga -ga -ga. Or Thundara, excuse me. It's more, yeah, I already said it's more efficient since. Since the maximum that you can do is. Uh, you know, 9,000... Ooh, that was hard. That was a hard hit. 999. Anything that's like over 4,500, basically, or 5,000, you know, it's... Um, oh, that's only... Okay, so Fusoya needs to cast <laughs> the uh, Thundaga, because his magic is not nearly as effective as um, hers. Black magic, Thundaga. He's gonna switch, I just know it. Okay, no, never mind. Now he switches. Dang it! And Fosoya's gonna drop a Thundaga on. Uh, what's her face? Uh. That's gonna. Okay. It did something. I thought it was gonna heal her. Um. Let's see. Uh, let's go ahead and just keep up with the. I 
I can't remember what's the best thing to cast against. Um. Uh, maybe it is just Thundara. Yeah, I'll just use Thundara. I don't remember. Ooh, ouchie. Whoa. Mmm. Ouch. Um, that was not good. Was that because we uh, attacked with a certain attack or what? I don't know. That wasn't good. Let's get everybody up. Wake up, everybody. Ah, oh, crap. Uh, white magic. Light magic, um... Alright, let's do this. Summon Leviathan. Gotcha. Throw a heal up. He's leaving himself exposed for a long time. Ow, that inferno just roasts us. Dang it. Get him. Maybe he doesn't cover himself with his cloak the second time around. Um, get him. Nice. Black magic. Uh, where's Blizzaga? Get him. Nice. Nice fight. Fasoya was with 18 MP left. We got you this time, Rubicante. And we only got 5,000 experience piece. Hmm, that's disappointing. Now oh, you had your last chance, Cagnazzo. Farewell, Valiance. Farewell, Rubicante. All right, uh, let's go back and um, use another tent. Actually, no, we're going to use a cottage because um, we're, uh, we're almost dry on MP. So we're going to use a cottage instead. All right, uh, we'll go ahead and save. And then we will proceed on. Oh no. Uh, let's see, uh, let's just focus fire on The giant soldier. That was overkill. That's okay. 
All right, a tent. I wonder if they drop those just specifically because there's that save point and it's like, oh, maybe the player forgot to buy uh, a tent or two. And so let's, uh, let's make sure that they have one. I don't know. I'll have you cast Thundaga. We'll just have you do a little dance. I don't know. You're kind of... <laughs> Ouch. Get him. Come on, Vasoya. Cast that spell. There we go. A cottage, hooray. Alright, here is the actual boss fight of the of the stage. This is what we came for. Top everybody off. Okay, here we go. It's CPU. Well, what's a CPU? I love how Fusoya gives us the strategy of the battle. <laughs> okay, we must be very, very careful that we attack the defense node and not the attack node. There we go. Ouch, that hurts. Mm. Um, black magic, white magic. Um, I guess let's pr cast protect. Oh, that's right. Dang it! I, I totally missed that he cast reflect on himself. On itself. Uh, yeah. Ouchie. <clears throat> and now Rydia's gonna zap herself. Dang it! Man, what an idiot. Uh... I think it's probably all down to, um... Does Protect stack? Let's see, I don't know, it, it... I guess... Hiya! <laughs> uh, where's haste? Let's cast haste on somebody. Yeah, it doesn't look like... Stacking Protect is doing anything for us. Charge my laser. Um, I don't remember how much health this thing has. Where's Kiraha? All right, come on, let's get him down. All right. <clears throat> nice. Hooray! Alright, edge is up to level 57!
guys, did we plan this? That the whole robot would blow up while we were in it? Alright, yeah, we stopped it, yeah, but, uh... Now what? Hey, it's Golbaz! How dare we? How dare you? You have to look deep inside yourself. Stop it! Don't make me think about my feelings! What's happening? Oh no! You have returned to your true self, and I'm gonna take a nap. My father is Cluia. What? Oh, we're brothers. Brothers hug. Yep, don't see the resemblance. Uh, yep. Ah, yes, of course. Yes, of course, it makes so much sense now. Say something, Cecil. Why were you chosen and not me? Oh. Now comes the self guilt. We don't even get to properly fight Gol Golbez. Well, then get up, old man. Come on. Brother, no. Is this what you want, Cecil? My brother? Yeah! Hello! That's what we've been saying. Cecil takes a minute to process things, guys. Especially now that the giant robot doesn't have a processing unit and it's gonna start falling apart. We gotta get out of here! I'm still thinking. Give me some time. <laughs> Uh, yeah, good question, Edge. What is he doing? This way. Kane! Good to see you, man. Haha, <laughs> Edge is wary. It's like, hey, don't pretend that you're gonna save us. What, are you gonna jump with us all on your back? Oh yeah, we'll just exit out of the same door that Golbez went out of. Why didn't we think of that? <laughs> Dirt. Blow that robot up. Yeah, get him. Uh, we'll, we'll probably find it on our heart to forgive you. You're a good guy. Oh, Edge, lighten up. Yeah, let Rosa be the voice of reasoning. The gentle white mage that she is. So the question is, right, how did Golbez have so much control over Cain? Since Cain's not a Lunarian. Golbez is Cecil's older brother. Ah, oh, yes. But I was Cecil's brother. I grew up with him. No mention of that, huh? <laughs> Edge does not forget easily betrayal. Oh. 
Just gave him a license to kill. Then it's decided we have our final party. Cecil, you haven't said anything. Uh, no. <laughs> I need a summoner and I need a healer. Shut up, Cecil. <laughs> But no, don't do it. Don't do it, Rosa. Such a bad idea. Oh, yeah. Arguably our two best party members, actually. <laughs> Alright. So we're not going to stay on the moon, actually. We're going to... Uh, go back to the... Uh, blue planet. Ha ha ha! She just was kidding! Oh, she's so romantic and mushy. <laughs> oh! Haha! <laughs> that's right. Oh, yeah, that's right. You can summon giant monsters. <laughs> Did you forget that little bit? It's like, so where were they hanging out <laughs> in the in the ride from the Earth to the Moon? <laughs> it's like, were they on the landing gear or where were they exactly? All right, let's go ahead and uh, rest and save and quit. Um, and then in our next episode, we're gonna, I think we're gonna go back to the underworld. Um, We'll buy some sirens from that shop. Um, I think we only need like 10 or 20. Anyway, uh, overwrite this file. Okay. All right, so we are, yeah, we're close. I think we only need um, two more episodes and then we'll be done. So until our next episodes, when we do a little bit of running around, get some items and um, last minute clean up things, I guess. So, until then, so long for now.